and welcome to the Mohegan Sun Casino and Resort in Uncasville, Connecticut, a couple hours drive from New York City. And we're here for the first Grand Prix of the World's Strongest Man Super Series. And our top four strongmen go on to the World's Strongest Man later in the year. Now this 10,000 seater stadium is getting packed for action. Sven, what kind of action are we going to see here? Well, it's one of the toughest events of the year and one of the biggest ones. We are at the beautiful stadium here at Mohegan, but you should have thought we were in Poland. It's almost 50% Polish people here roaring for Poland and Mariusz Pudzianowski. Mariusz Pudzianowski, three times world's strongest man, twice a winner here. Now, Bill Kazmaier, you know what it's like to win three times at Worlds, but for the Americans, they're quite a young contingent here, aren't they? Like Kevin Nee is our local favorite. He's a little smaller in stature, but if you measure the size of his heart, it's huge. I think he's going to do well. Now, Sven, talk us through the first event, the Super Yoke. How hard is it? Well, the Super Yoke, as you know, one of my old favorites. But I hope for the Norwegian old Haugen to come through here. But since we are in a gambling place, I put my money on Marius here as well. Well, we have Marius Pudzianowski and 11 other gladiators here as well. Who's going to take the four slots? Let's have a look at the guys. Darren Sadler, 27 years old, Borough Bridge, England. Terry Hollands, 27 years old, from Darford, England. Kevin Nee, 21, Hopedale, Massachusetts, USA. Jason Bergman, 29, Appleton, Wisconsin, USA. Hi, I'm Louis Philippe Jean, 22 years old, from Quebec, Canada. Hey, I'm Marshall M. Dub White, 24 years old, Port Angeles, Washington. Hi, my name is Alhaza Wadislav. I'm 29 years of age and I'm from Israel. Jason Paulin, Canada. Mark Philippi, 39, Las Vegas, Nevada, USA. Mark Felix, 41 years old. Originally from Grenada, but now we live in England. Old Haugen, 57, Norway, King of the Pack. Mariusz Pudzianowski, 30 years old, from Poland. What a lineup of athletes, including the great Mariusz Pudzianowski, three times world's strongest man from Poland. And some other good names, as well as the first ever Israeli athlete, Vlad Aladzov. Vulcan Super Yoke, 400 kilos, 880 pounds, and it has to go 100 feet. Mark Felix of the UK, formerly Grenada, 42 years old now, very powerful man, 6'3", over 300 pounds, up against the 21-year-old Kevin Nee, a Massachusetts man. Well, last year, you know, was very disappointing. It was uh, my first really good international showing. I mean, I was in second place going into the last event, and I pretty much had second place locked up because of the, the way that I thought the scoring was. Well, I ended up not being able to start the event because I couldn't flip the finger finger, and I got zero points because they, they, cut, they counted as me not being able to start the event. So I got zero points while everyone else got 14, 15, 16 points and I ended up going from second place to fifth place. So that was, that was a heartbreaker because top four qualified for Worlds so I didn't qualify right up front and then I didn't get my first podium finish either so it was uh, pretty devastating. It, if I'm right on and I, and, and I do what I know I'm capable of doing, I think I can get top three. To tell the truth, I'm looking forward to all events. I'm ready. I've been training really hard. You know, I haven't leave anything untouched. I've been doing dream training. I've been doing 20 event training, working on all my weekly event. I'm ready for every event. To tell the truth. I do have a goal though, and I'm going to say it right now, Mark Felix. Nothing personal, but last time I competed against you, we were tied going into the last event, and you got me. So I'm, I'm trying to get you this time. So. <laughs> you know, I mean, I don't know what Kevin E been doing or what he been reading about, but he don't know who I am really. So, tell him bring it on. I'm ready for him. Years 
old, he's behind the UK man, Mark Felix, 42 years old, and Felix, he's in the lead, but he's crossing lanes here. Well, he has to be careful not to be disqualified, but he's got him right on the line. Mark Felix, 14.97 seconds, just ahead of Kevin Nee. Two very quick times. Mark, great time. What's the secret there? Well, I've been doing, I'm putting a lot of training, you know, so, I mean, we are training is really rugged, so, when I come in places like here, it's like Christmas to me, I love it. Kevin, you angry with that or happy? No, you know what, Mark's a great competitor, me and him have had some great battles over the years, and, uh, you know, i got to tip my hat to the better man this time, so, congratulations, you know, but maybe I'll get you next time, so. <laughs> Let him boys. Mark. Jason Bergman, USA in his first international. So too is this man, Vlad Alidzov, champion powerlifter from Israel. He's squatted over 500 kilos, but his legs have given way already. This is a very specific strength, but Bergman works at Gold's Gym as a personal fitness trainer. And 14.41, uh, he's personally got himself in great shape for this show. As for Alidzov, Baptism of fire here at the Mohegan Sun, just getting over the line in 25.69 seconds. And from a very inexperienced pair to a pair with a huge wealth of experience, Jesson Polav, Canada, three times Canada's strongest man against 57-year-old Odd Haugen from Norway. And Paula up okay, but oh, he's gone down already. Odd Haugen though making the running here. Mr. Norway back in 1968. That's right, 68. He's doing well, he's making all the running. And Canada's strongest man is getting a beating here. Fabulous time, 20.69 seconds for Haugen. And Paul Howe, wobbly legs. The 900 pounds crushing down on his back and he just finishes so on with the contest and it's Luis Philippe Jean second place in Canada's strongest man against Marshall White of the USA M-Dub as he likes to be known hails from uh, near Seattle Washington trains with Jesse Marunde who's uh, injured at the moment with bad knees and he's trained this young man up very well but uh, even younger is the Canadian and again it's a real head-to-head -head. don't forget nearly 900 pounds and Marshall White well here's another debutant doing extremely well so too the Canadian enjoy that yeah very much so <laughs> that's like uh, 10 seconds shorter than capacity of the qualifier for this you gonna be Marius at it <laughs> Have you seen Marius? <laughs> Hopefully, but we'll see. You're enjoying this, are you? You're yeah, up for the big stage. Very much so. I set a goal of 17 seconds, I did 16, so... Bravo, well done. Yeah, yeah. In your face. Great time there. Darren Sadler, though, up next. The pocket rocket from Borough Bridge in Northern England against the veteran. Now over 40 years old, Mark Philippi from Las Vegas. Philippi. Spent the last year building up a huge gym in Las Vegas, but he still managed to maintain a lot of strength, and Darren Sadler could be getting taught a lesson here. Sadler normally so quick at these kind of events. Well, I wonder whether this extreme weight has troubled him. Philippi, of course, former world powerlifting champion, over the line in just over 17 seconds. Oh, and Sadler, in his desperation to catch up, comes short of the line. Polish flags, I wonder who they're calling for, unbelievable, 5,000 people here, there must be 4,000 Poles, no joke. Budzinowski in the final pairing against Big Terry Hollands, 425 pounds of menace from Dartford, England, that's 190 kilos. My vegan summer was a great competition for me last year, but a really good first event and um, come out all guns blazing. It filtered off a bit towards the end, but yeah, it was a great start and really enjoyed it. I'm hoping to do exactly the same this year as I did last year. Um, get a good placing on the first event and hopefully build from there. Uh, Terry, I don't have a chance. The Super York is my event and I win. I show you who is faster and who has no legs.
Polska Gurang, Polish power, that's what his fans cheer. They've just gone silent here, waiting for the start of this race. Terry Holland's a little slow there. Those huge legs of his, though, from rugby days, and now powerlifting and strongman catching up on Pudzianowski. But Pudzianowski accelerating away again as 11.94 destroys anybody else. Goodness me, that was lightning. Holland's, though, good enough for second. Easy for you? <laughs> no, no, not easy because it's 400 kilo. Only 400 kilo. 11 seconds. Oh, it's medium time, I think. Well, if Marius wasn't so fast, you'd look great then. You happy? I'm a bit disappointed with the start. Made a terrible mess of the start. Got a bit of a wobble on, but second place, I think, so I'm happy with that. It's all these English fans. That's it. <laughs> Where are they? They're all Polish. <laughs> yeah, everyone Poland. Polska Gurom. Well done. Thanks. Happy times for Poland. Pudzianowski, where he normally is, at the top. Holland's in second. Jason Bergman of the USA down in third. Mohegan Sun's an incredibly busy venue. Our guys are setting up right now for World Strongest Man Super Series. Just in the recent few months, we've had Justin Timberlake, big name acts, we're getting ready for Gwen Stefani, another slew of big name acts all through the summer. We do more than 100 concerts here. We do the WNBA, the women's basketball. We do all sorts of sporting events here. And for us, it's a great venue to work in, and it's hopefully great for the crowd to be here. Event 2 is the Viking Press, and this thousand-pound slot machine is on this incredible contraption that you have to pick up your shoulders and push overhead for as many reps as possible. It's around about 330 pounds on the shoulders, 150 kilos. The Viking. Who better to tell us about the Viking Press? How hard? Well, it's a good test of uh, shoulder strength, Colin. And it's going to be very interesting to see if somebody can give Marius a fight for the money here. I reckon Kevin Neon on home soil is going to put in a big score. Marius could be in trouble. First few competitors up found the going tough. Sadler managed eight reps. Out next, Jess and Paula. The shoulders gave way after four. Vlad Aladzov, the big powerlifting Israeli, nine. Odd Haugen managed to push out five. Marshall White, M-Dub, did six. Louis-Philippe Jean managed seven. So, on to a legend, Mark Philippi. Former USA Strongest Man back in 98. Since then, he's had many visits to the World's Strongest Man finals. Never managed to hit the podium, though. Referee Yoko Ahola, two times world's strongest man himself, strict here, got to lock him out. Eight repetitions for Philippi, one more to equal the lead, he's done it. Great stuff from the Las Vegas man. Feel like talking? I always feel like talking. <laughs> It was heavier than I thought it was going to be. That was amazing, My Ted. It feels like hell. I've been battling a little bit, so I was happy with that. That's great, Mark. Appreciate it. Stones now. <laughs> How high are the platforms? <laughs> Pretty high. <laughs> thanks. That's thanks to you. 